hello students so in this video we will be solving the exercise 2a from rs agarwal cbsc grade 9 so as you can see the question says that in which of the following expressions are polynomials and also we need to find if they are polynomial their degree so what is called a polynomial polynomial is an algebraic expression in which the variables involved will have only the non-negative integral powers it should have only non-negative integral powers so there should not be any negative power upon any variable also there should not be any fractions upon any variable the power should not be fraction should not be negative it must be non-negative integral so from like 0 1 2 3 4 those are only applicable then we can say that that algebraic expression is a polynomial and how to figure out the degree degree of a polynomial is the highest power of the variable on that algebraic expression or all or, or on that given polynomial so I'm doing the first main first one so we can see it's x to the power 5 minus 2x cube plus x plus 7 so neither the powers are negative neither the powers are a fraction so obviously it's an polynomial so we can write it is an polynomial and the degree is 5 because we can see the highest power of the variable is 5 that is x to the power 5 and other variables are 3 and 1 and 0 so highest is 5 so it will be the polynomial will have the degree 5 second one it's x cube root 3 y so x cube minus root 3 y we can see the root is not over the y so that means this y will have the power 1 and this y has the power 3 so it's in polynomial yes and the degree is 3 highest power of the variable y is 3 so yes it's in polynomial and the degree is 3 next one is t square 2 by 5 t plus root 2 so again it don't have any negative or fractional power upon the variables the coefficient that is the coefficient that is the number along with the variable can be fraction can be negative doesn't matter we are just talking about the power of the variable so it is it, it, it is pol it is polynomial so yes and the highest power we can see 2 so the degree will be 2 okay the fourth one the fourth one is 5 root z minus 6 5 under root z minus 6 so if I convert the root z into the power we know how to do the exponent so it will be z to the power half minus 6 so we can see it's not a polynomial because the z the variable having an fraction so it's not a polynomial and as it is not a polynomial it don't have any degree only the polynomials can have the degree okay the fifth one x minus 1 by x okay x minus 1 by x so if I simplify it it will be x to the power minus 1 x minus x to the power minus 1 because we know that x to the power minus 1 equals to 1 by x so we can see it has the variable uh, the variable having the negative power so again a no a big no no degree so sixth one let's see the sixth one it's 108 minus 1 so obviously it's in polynomial yes and the degree will be the highest power in that case it will be 108 the seventh one it's cube root x minus 27 it's cube root x minus 27 so if I simplify it it will be x to the power 3 minus 27 x to the power 1 by 3 
So we can see the variable again having the fraction. So a big no again and therefore no degree. Okay. The next one is 1 by root 2 x square minus root 2 x. The root is not over x and plus 2. So it's a polynomial, the eighth one. So it's a polynomial and the degree will be what? Degree will be the highest power of the variable which is in this case 2. Okay. The ninth one x to the power minus 2 plus 2 to the power uh, 2x to the power minus 1 plus 3. So obviously it has the negative power. So a big no again. Tenth one, the 1. So we can write it as 1 into x to the power 0. Why x to the power 0? Because we know x to the power 0 is equals to 1. So, yes. Because 0 is a non-negative integral, so yes. And degree is again 0. If you have only a constant term, the degree will be always 0. And that will be a polynomial. The 11th one, 11th one is given minus 3 by 5 so it will be minus 3 by 5 into x to the power 0 so a big yes and the degree will be 0 and the 12th one under root a uh, cube root of 2 y square minus 8 it's given cube root of 2 y square minus 8 so cube root is not above the variable it's only with the cons coefficient part so and the, the power above the variable is in con uh, non-negative integral so a big yes and the degree will be 2 so hope you have enjoyed the video in the next part of the video we will be solving the rest of the exercise. Thank you very much.